Hey guys, welcome to Bauchi Kitchen. Today my husband is helping me in the kitchen to prepare our own favorite artichoke. Alright guys, I'm just going to tell you a little bit about the artichoke. So, when you go to the grocery store and you got to pick out your artichoke, first you want to make sure that the leaves are packed tightly. And then, I always look at the heart, the center piece right here. The bigger that is, the bigger your heart will be, and that's my favorite part of the artichoke. So look for a big part of the artichoke, a big heart of the artichoke. Now when you go to prepare these guys, you'll see all these leaves around the, the exterior. We're just going to rip those off. Don't worry about taking off any meat because the meat's going to stay on the stock. So we're going to take those off. And one more. See, all the meat stays on the, the stalk of the artichoke. So we've got those. We're going to trim off just a little bit. I've seen people cut off this whole stalk. That's a bad idea because there's a whole lot of heart in the stalk. So we're just going to take off just enough. There you go. Now you can see the inside of the heart. She's nice and big. So we've got that. The next thing that we're going to do is cut off these spines. You'll notice the artichoke actually will flower if you let it grow long enough. Um, so we're going to cut off all of these spines because it makes it dangerous to handle. So I'm going to grab a pair of scissors. Alright guys, so I've got my scissors. We're just going to snip off all of these little spines from the leaves. Alright guys, so I've got all of the spines chopped off of these upper leaves. Now for the next part, we're going to chop off the bottom portion to, to make it flat so that she'll sit in the pan better when she's boiling. Um, we've already got our pan of boiling water in the back, so I'm just going to chop this real quick. Alright, so we've got that. It's as flat as we can get it. Um, so we're just going to throw her into the pot to boil for about 45 minutes and then we'll show you when she's all ready to eat. Um, before I throw her in there, I'm going to season the water just because when you season the water, that's going to get into the, the flavor of the leaves. So we're going to throw some salt and some pepper in there. Just boiling water already. Probably about a tablespoon, maybe a tablespoon and a half of salt. Not going to do as much pepper, just a couple grinds. Perfect. Alright, so we're going to throw this in and let her boil for about 45 minutes. Some people will put like um, a bowl on top to hold her down because the artichokes will float. Um, but I'm going to cover this. As long as it's covered, the steam will also cook the leaves. And she'll be ready here in about 45 minutes. Alright guys, it's been about 45 minutes. And we're going to check and make sure that this artichoke's done. So I'm going to grab her by the base of the leaves. As you can see, she's already a little tender up top, so she's probably done. Best way to test is to pull off a leaf. If she comes off like that, you know she's ready to eat. So there's bunch of the meat um, so she's nice and tender she's ready to eat we're gonna let her cool a little bit and I'm gonna show you guys um, after we take off some of the exterior leaves I'll also show you how to get to the heart the best part of the artichoke um, so that you guys can enjoy the the heart of the artichoke so I just melted some butter three tablespoons to be precise um, our butter is unsalted and organic so I'm gonna add a little bit of salt to this just because for this specific recipe, I like my, my butter to have a little bit of salt in it. I'm also going to add a dash of garlic powder just for the flavor in the butter. Alright, there's a little sprinkle of that. Um, so that's the sauce that we make and then you just dip the leaves into this sauce. I'm going to give it a quick stir. Let me try this. Mmm. Perfect. 
As you can see, you scrape the meat off of the leaf with your teeth. You just kind of pull all that out when you eat it. So we're going to go ahead and eat some of these leaves and we'll get back to when it's time for the heart. Remember when we cut off all of those thorns earlier? This is when that really pays off because you don't have to worry about getting stabbed when you pull off the leaves. And as you can see, when I seasoned the water earlier, all of that pepper goes inside. Whatever you season your water with, that goes down into the leaves. So that's why it's important to season your water uh, while the artichoke's cooking. You can see all those flakes of the, the peppercorns um, are, are deep inside the leaves. So when you take those fresh bites off of the leaves, you're going to get that mouthful of all your seasoning. So you can be creative with your seasoning. I'm pretty generic just because I, I like to do the seasoning in my butter. Just another couple layers here. As you can see there's a lot of leaves and you're aiming for the meaty part. I'll take another bite of one of these just because it's so delicious. You dip that in some butter. See how I scraped all the meat off of the leaf? You can, you can eat all the meat. There's a ton of meat on these leaves. so trying to do this but it's also still very hot ah, trying to get to the inside so that we can do the heart here for you guys that's a lot of meat for uh, 370 grams of artichoke it's adorable so healthy guys it's pretty hot still so we have to uncover all those leaves dad right yeah you, you have to take all these leaves off getting down to the part where I'm not really huge these leaves get pretty thin so you almost end up eating the leaf when you get down this far into the artichoke so we'll take it out it's really hot in the center though because we just cooked it so I'm gonna grab I'm gonna grab my tongs here that's the artichoke meat look at that and these are the leaves as you can see these are just gonna come right out oh yeah that's pretty easy huh And we're starting to get down. So like I mentioned earlier, the artichoke will flower if you let her grow long enough. A fork real quick. So we did boil this for 45 minutes, Dad, right? Yep, 45 minutes. Just as soon as the leaves pull off like you saw, she's ready. Wow, that looks So I'm going to scrape up the rest of these little leaves here so we can get down to these fibrous hairs. Is it kind of sharp too? Yeah, there, there are some spines on this part right here, but these aren't nearly as sharp as the ones we cut off earlier. Okay. Alright, so once you get down to this fibrous hair area, I scrape this out just with a fork. Um, you want to be careful not to go too deep because now we're getting down to the heart. So as you can see, these come out like so. I'm going gonna to scrape these off onto the plate here. Oh, that looks so good now. Alright guys, so there it is. The best part of the artichoke, the heart. So, what we're going to do now, I'm just going to use this fork and I'm going to cut this directly into this bowl of melted butter that we made. And I'm, gonna, I'm just going to start cutting like this. It's really tender. That's how you know it's cooked properly. It'll be tender enough. You can just sli slice right through this like hot butter. And all this is meat. So you see all this outer stuff from where we plucked the leaves earlier? That's all the good, the greatness of the artichoke heart. <laughs> so we're going to chop this all off into bite-sized pieces for me and the missus to fight over. 
All right, so now, remember how some people throw this part away? You can just slice right down the middle of this, and she'll open right up. And voila, more artichoke heart, guys. Wow. Look at all of that amazing greatness. And this is, the artichoke is loaded with fiber, so this is a really, really good vegetable for you to eat. Um, lots of antioxidants, really healthy vegetable. So we're just going to scrape that out. You can even eat this part. It's just not as tender. So I'm going to scrape out the heart there. Wow, that looks so And see, I can, I can still cut right through the stem for the most part. It's well done. Very good. It looks so tasty, Dad. All right, guys. If you've ever seen Hearts of Palm in the restaurants, um, that's that part that I just cut out. That's the Hearts of Palm, and you would be a fool to throw that away. So there she is, soaked in butter, ready for me and the missus to fight over. Mm -hmm. um, we're gonna dip the leaves in this butter, and we're gonna devour this. Wow. There you go. There you are, guys. Artichoke on Super Bouncy Kitchen. Hope you guys enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, leave your comments below, and enjoy. Thank you for watching. There it is, guys. The artichoke on plate. We plated all the leaves, and then especially the heart. Heart's there. Don't let this intimidating vegetable shy you from cooking it anymore. Now you know all the secrets of the artichoke. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this, guys.